Yo guys, welcome back to another video on the Best Dodge channel and today it is Premier League predictions and let's get started with the Friday night game with Southampton versus Norwich. So Southampton are tenth, Norwich are I believe bottom of the league. Um Southampton they are on quite good form. They've only lost one of the last five. But Norwich have lost the last, have uh, lost the last two games. But for this game, I am going to be saying a one nil to Southampton. And moving on to Leeds versus Spurs. Now, if you had seen this, it always amounts in three goals. Um. All this amounts in three goals. Leeds have been on terrible form. Um, lost four of the last five, which what was a draw. And then top the bat on the best. They've only won one of the last five. And because it always ends in three goals, like last three times we've played three nil Spurs, um, three one Leeds, and a three one to um no two one Spurs. Which I'm gonna go for again, so I am gonna say um Leeds one, Spurs two. Then moving on to Brentford Newcastle, which it sort of is a relegation um game, but Brentford aren't really in the relegation places anymore. I mean there never was, but Newcastle, what have you got to say? Five of the last five, they haven't lost three wins, two draws. But Brentford, they lost four of the last five. Um, 14th Brentford versus 17th Newcastle. Um, I, I don't think I'm saying two um, nil to Newcastle. Then moving on to Brighton versus Aston Villa. Now, 9th Brighton and 13th um, Aston Villa. Brighton have only won one of the last five and they did lose against Burnley, which I did predict. Um, but Aston Villa, I am going to say a, another one or draw. And then moving on to Palace, Burnley. Now, Palace, they are a good team. They always finish... Mid table, they're eleventh. One winner for the last five. Uh, Burnley, they are in the relegation places now, but I don't think they will get relegated. Burnley, I think if we Newcastle, who will dip into relegation spots. But this might surprise you, but I am gonna say two nil to Burnley. I think they played really good last week. Um, but I just think it's gonna be like that. And then moving on to Manchester. United, who were lucky to get a draw against Atletico Madrid, against Watford. Now, Watford are 19th in the league. Um, they are on OK form, uh, Manchester United. Uh, Watford only won one of the last five, and they are 19th. And I can't see it, United losing it, so I am going to say 3 0 to. No, I'm going to say 3 1. To Manchester United and then moving on to my team Everton versus Manchester City obviously we bottled it last week against um, Tottenham <coughs> yeah so we need to get back to winning ways against um, Everton and I do think we will beat Lampard so you should play for Man City for a little bit and I'm going to say a 2-1 win to Manchester City. Uh, moving on to the games on Sunday. Obviously, Chelsea-Leicester um, has been postponed because Chelsea are in the Carabao Cup final. But I'm going to predict it because it's going to happen anyway. So I'm going to say Chelsea versus Leicester. Now, whenever it happens... Actually, no, I'm not going to predict it. I'm going to predict West Ham versus Wolves which is a Premier League game and I'm going to say 
two one to West Ham. I just think it'll be their game and then moving on to a double game week for Burnley because they play on Tuesday. I won't be watching it because Man City are on, uh, are on the FA Cup against uh, Peterborough on Tuesday. So Burnley, I'm going to say one or draw. Obviously, I think they played good against um, Tottenham. But yeah, I think it's going to be like that. And now I'm going to predict the Carabao Cup final versus Chelsea versus Liverpool. Now, Chelsea, they've been on a K form, but I think the Merseyside mugs are going to win it. I think it'll go to extra time and then Salah will score. But then I'm now going to end the video now. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.